What's going on, guys? Oscar here. My man Carlos. Gay. Ladies, you know what to do. We're back with another video. Um, Beto so, here. Yeah, Albert. Beto. So, I've had a lot of people asking me about the difference between the Belltech uh, Street Performance shocks and along with the uh, Air Ride shocks that I have right now. Um, right now, I have the Air Ride shocks on right now. You guys probably seen the video of that. But uh, I felt like I was, or I didn't feel like Short it. Short Stories Charm, they're st shit. No, they're not shit. They're a pin in the ass and play. Yeah, that's it. But that's what you get I was going to do like a comparison to them, like, you know, whether which one you should really get. You know, it all depends on, on your truck and whatnot, but I feel like I'm going to do that right now. Got Carlos, Master Mechanic Christian, and the homie Beto. Oh, he just got here. And I'm looking good. But yeah, we're going to get to that right now, right? Yep. Oh. Still, still, like, like it's probably like. Don't be much. afraid, Oscar. I know, but god damn. Just put it on the, the bed, on the. Now he already puts the rocks. Put it right there. What? On the this. Yeah, yeah. Right now, Oscar's trying to lift the truck, but my jack stands are fucking tall as fuck. Yeah, huh? Is that the neighbors? Hmm? Is that the the jack oh. No, it's mine, dude. Never mind. You bought that one? No, I haven't ever since. Eh? No, he's talking about the Jack. Oh, that one? Oh, no, that's Oscar's Jack. That's some good quality shit. Harbor Break? Harbor yeah. Break? Harbor Break sounds like his one that broke. <laughs> yeah. Alright. So, yeah, Oscar's right now trying to jack the troquita. Oh, yeah. So, next, tomorrow, we're having a cruise, right? The beach cruise. Yeah, so this video is probably gonna be edited tonight. So we're gonna upload it today. Or you should go to the Legal Siete fucking meet and greet. Yeah. I know, the roads are shitty, Wait, dude. What are, you, what are you doing? Yeah, we. Yeah. Ya empezó? Ya va bien, madre. Where's the. Oh, these are the air lift shocks. If you guys want them, they're up for sale. Are they? Go to my throttle. Go to his throttle.com. No, go to his offer up. That's the getaway. Christian being a mechanic like always. Oh, by the way, pretty, pretty much the reason why he's doing this. So for the cruise tomorrow. So he has no, better no. handling. Yeah, huh? Really. Shut up, Oscar. You just say yes. Yes. Exactly. Are they in? Yeah. Yeah. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, man. These don't really take that long. It's just... Just leaf springs are the bitch. Just the leaf springs are. Take it for a spin! Oscar driving. Fucking bad, those 350. Pretty much he doesn't let a lot of people drive his car. You're like, fuck no. Hell no. <coughs> it doesn't sit. It's pretty good right now. I mean, it like, didn't move <laughs> at all. <laughs> Woo! Woo! These are supposed to be better think, because they're like, they're more towards like handle, like a handling type of deal rather than those air shocks that are kind of like just for support. Oh, there's that faggot. You know him? Oh, it's a lady. She's still a faggot. <coughs> Your car's shit. An 8 Series though. Nah, ooh, I like it, dude. It's not bad. It's not bad. You know what it reminds me of? Yeah. The fucking Mercedes, the one, the C63, I think, AMG. You know my thing is, that I feel like if I hit bumps, though, like really hard bumps, then I'll go hit drive shaft. Hit it, wait. I'm gonna Hell. Really hit the one right here. <laughs> go airborne? Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get off! That was a hundred. Oh shit! <laughs> Did nothing serious. I think ride well. Like, honestly, it's better. There's I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take a turn over here because this road's pretty bumpy. Oh shit! You see that motherfucker? <laughs> Let's fly, dude. No. Please. Do carro, yeah. Oh yeah. So I can put in the rear. <coughs> and someone has 
up and probably Oscar will pay you. Yeah, I'll buy him. Up here. Yeah, I want to buy him. Like it's handling the bumps pretty well. Uh huh. Let's wait till we get up front and more up there because that's when it's like super bouncy. Alright. I prefer these ones a lot better than the um, air shocks. Than the air shocks. Reason being is because one, the air shocks are just a pain in the ass that you have to pump them up with a bicycle pump unless you have like a compressor with you. I do. Yeah. <laughs> and some guy. Oh, hey! Shout out to that guy who he messaged me. He, I wait. He recognized me. I was thinking of my brother. He recognized me. Oh fuck! Shout out to him! Shout out to him! I hope you realize that once you drop a truck from the front or from the rear, your suspension gets like a lot stiffer, like a lot stiffer. Like my E36. It doesn't um, matter what kind of truck or car. It doesn't um, matter unless you get good well, quality well, suspension. Then well, that's not even that. Um, the reason I say that is because we don't have like you know the shocks and springs like you, the struts and springs like you do. Like on the front, it's just a spindle shock absorber that's holding that's holding uh -huh. the suspension so let alone those aren't the best anyways but in the rear you've got the leaf spring as well with the support of another shock um those leaf springs <coughs> are only there to like support weight really you know so comparing these ones to the to the, the air ride shocks um i'll have to say i like these ones a lot better actually so what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to keep them keep them on um so if anybody like wants those air ride shocks, like you know, hit me up. I'll sell them to you. You know, you've seen uh, the video of us installing them on there. Um, they're not difficult. Literally two bolts you have to do. And I have what's it called? Four on each. Well, two on each shock. I have what's it called? Extra hoses. If you guys need that as well too, which more than likely you will. Um, and if you guys really like need help, you can always just like watch the rewatch the video to show you how to do it. It's really simple. Really, really simple. The only thing that I guess would kind of take you a while or be kind of hard, not really, it's just like where you want your wiring, like where you want your, your lines to go through and whatnot, you know? But the reason why I, why I decided that I was like, oh, I'm just going to put back my original Belltech Street Performance ones was because I, I always rode with the air off anyways. I, my, my thing was is like, oh, once I get my thinner tires on the rear, now I'm going to be hitting drive shock because I had such a big, big, beefy tire. I, I, I thought that's what was helping me from hitting not hitting drive shaft. So, um, Shit. so I got those. Now they're gone. Back onto the Beltec Street Performance all the way around. Uh -huh. um, but yeah, let alone, like, I, all I've used is Beltec everything on this truck. So I've got Beltec spindle, lowering spindles on the front. That boy. Beltec lowering blocks, Beltec leaf spring, Beltec shock absorbers, the street performance. Um, and it's held up. They're like a genuine good product. I like by no means are we sponsoring by 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 this or anything like that. I'm just you know genuinely telling you guys that Beltec is a really good company. They've been
been in business and I think in Bakersfield is where they're located. But they built. built. But the, <laughs> the build's done. No, I'm just kidding. Um, they've been they've been doing stuff for trucks for like years now, so they they build really good quality products. Um, so if you guys are like watching these videos and plan on building a mini truck, I highly suggest starting with Belltech. Um, I wouldn't go to like AutoZone or O'Reilly's and you know ask if they have any like parts for trucks and stuff like that to lower them because uh, I don't know I just wouldn't recommend that I'd rather you get them from like an actual good company you know, Rock Auto who, No not Rock Auto Alright guys so editing the video right now um, I forgot to close out the video like always um, but with that being said I just want to say thank you to every single one of you guys who watched today's video if you guys haven't already, please like, comment, share, and subscribe as it really does mean a lot to us. And we will see you guys along with the whole Carbon Squad in the next video. Peace out.